This playthrough is rated M for Mature. Greetings and salutations, everyone. Valdemar here with more Dead Space 3. Oh, poor, poor Bennett, Wallace, whatever his name was. I hardly knew you. Seriously, I hardly knew you. Now you're dead. Well, sucks for you. But Isaac's still alive, and we've got a job to do. Gotta save my girlfriend! Sorry, that's pretty much what the gist of it is. Uh, okay, so we need to check and see what's in the basement, because there are some creepy crawlies, and they didn't want to check it out, because it's ew, scary. Oh, nice, a bench. And a caster recovery model. Okay, I don't know. I noticed there's a lot of stuff I've gotten that I've never used, mainly because it's meant for multiplayer mode. There's actually a couple things you can upgrade your uh, um, items with. It's like, oh, well, this is used for multiplayer mainly, and you're like, oh. Uh, okay, well, that's kind of cool. I like that. That's kind of neat. But mech support heals partner. Well, that'd be great if I was playing multiplayer mode, but I am not. See, that would be cool having all that stuff, but eh. So I don't really need to... I'll mess with all that off screen. I don't want to take the whole episode doing that, so. Mainly just to use it to drop off stuff. So, I need to open that door. Let's see if I can. Excellent. Now I just need to grab a gear, I guess, and just use that to open, open the door over there. Let's see. I guess it doesn't matter. Just a gear will do. I bet it popped up behind me, but I didn't notice it. It's the big ass monster. Huh. Well, sorry, it would have been freakier, I guess, if I had actually, like, seen it, but I didn't. We just heard it. Or maybe it passed by through there. Ah, it doesn't matter. Let's just open the door so we can, uh, get on with the story. Yay! I think, that, yeah, this is because they didn't go to the basement because they were afraid of the, the creepy crawlies down there. Ooh. Yeah, I'll check that out. Well, no, I need a scavenger bot. Never mind. That way, if, if there is a spot to uh, scavenge stuff down there, I'll take advantage of it. And surprise, surprise, I do actually do stuff off camera just to kind of find stuff I may have missed while, while, mess, while messing around, so. Oh, nice. Alright. I wonder if there's one in here at all. And it shows one like outside, so... Alright. Let's see what the basement has to offer. Oh, and I didn't realize my uh, heat signature. Alright. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's see what's in the, the creepy crawly basement. I recommend 41st Engineering. I told them not to eat the infected. Then they started changing. Became sensitive to bright light. Just shining my flashlight would send them into a violent rage. I disabled the elevator to trap them down there. God rest their souls. All right. Apparently, this is, I thought this was optional, but I guess I do need to do this to uh, to uh, get my suit basically fixed, so I don't have to worry so much about the weather. I think it'll still be a problem. But, oh God! What the hell was that? Spooky, scary skeleton. I've also uh, changed my weapon out to see if this one will be any more effective than the previous gun. It wasn't a terrible weapon, it's just... It wasn't very effective against the monsters I was currently fighting, so... I lost out on that. I, the pet ejector thing still didn't work. Oh, I bet it's because my suit's broken. I bet that's why it's not working properly. That makes sense. Hmm... Whoever that creature was. Didn't look like a staring necromorph, but who knows? They keep evolving. So. But I can't smack hanging dead bodies. Ooh. That's not creepy at all. Uh, nothing going on in here. We're just hanging around. That's all we're doing. Uh, I heard that. Must be a new type of necromorph. Well, I was saying they might not be, but they probably are. I mean, man, maybe I should equip that grenade one I had earlier. Bam! 
Well, that worked well for a second, anyway. Oh god, they're surrounding my ass. Get off me! Get off me! Oh god! Cool weapon, but it has a charge time and low respawn rate. Or not respawn, whatever. Basically, I had to waste a couple of medicines just to, or med tanks, just to not die from that. Man, good weapon, but you are slow. You're good for like the first strike, man. <laughs> After that, switch the cutter. Oh, I mean, that was pretty cool. Just a big old beam, just brrr, big ass laser, but yeah, not good for those guys. I need I need a quick quick gun for that one, or at least I start out with it and then I switch to the weapon if I really wanted to. Well, probably not the best place to try it out, but yeah, what can you do? You have to try it out sometime, right? I'll start off with this and then switch to my. Ooh, I didn't even check to see if there was a place to dump the bottom around here. Nope. Yeah, you guys saw me at pretty much my worst there. <laughs> just, just scrambled to not get killed. I'm like, ah, ah, ah. Oh, what's this? Personal log, Sam Ackerman. <laughs> Three days, I've been quiet, hiding in the dark. I have to get to the radio, call for help. I think there may be a way around them by throwing small objects. I can, I can, I can trick them into investigating the noise. Ackerman, is that you? Oh God. I smell you! I smell... Oh, so that's what they are. Those guys are basically people who've eaten pieces of the survivors. Or basically cannibals who've also fleshed on necromorphs. Fuck you. <laughs> Just use the break breakingness of, of the door to prevent them from doing anything else. Ow, bitch. Ah! Fuck you! <laughs> Get off me! Get off me! That was fucked up. The game got all glitched out because it couldn't see past past the door. And that's why you should work a little longer on your games, buddy. That way you don't have to mess with that shit. Another upgrade ship. Yeah, I guess we're starting to get into that territory where... Yeah, that makes sense that the damage ships would have the most, uh, would have a negative on them, because, I mean, damage is the most important part of the game. Hmm. Okay, so, I'm supposed to... Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, good old, good thing I've got the, kept the plasma gun on me. Or if I use this, this... More of those creatures. Oh, an artifact, huh? Let's see what this one says. Excerpt from Scaf Legionary Handbook. Surviving sub-zero temperatures. You are required to wear an Arctic survival suit when executing the compound, no matter how small the duration. Zero tolerance, no exceptions. Do not use suits with obvious worn seams, tears, or loose seals in the helmet. Turn these into requisitions immediately. A hole, however small, is enough to let the cold in, leading to death in less than a minute. 
use of the catheter and colonics colonic systems is mandatory. In the event you are caught outside for an extended period, bodily functions can compromise suit's insulation. Catheter and colonic systems are sterilized after each use and are perfectly safe. Keep your suit, suit sealed, free of ice at all times. Don't stomp snow off your boots as the reverberations will damage the catheter and colonic systems. Hmm. I wonder how Isaac was able to survive. I don't know. But we've got an issue. We've got more of these. Basically, they, they attack in droves, so I could either sneak around them or kill them all. On the harder difficulties, you probably would want to just sneak around, or unless you're playing like a new game plus mode where you have like a lot of the best weaponry that might not even matter. As soon as I get a lot of tungsten, I'll be able to make some pretty nice little looking guns. I might not even have to worry about switching out after that. I've heard there's some pretty cool electric weapons that you can get later on, so we'll have to... We'll mess with that when we get to it. I guess if there's anything neat about this game, it is the different type of weaponry you can create. But I mean, other than that, okay, and this will start the generator, I assume. Huh? Okay, that one's not working. There we go. Restart. Quick, start the reactor. Or however you're supposed to say. I'm afraid to go in there just because it's gonna. Yeah, I see. I assume I have to slow it down when it gets to the that point. Or I could probably run on that. I, if, if you're unsure about it, you could slow it down. Ooh, I think my food's catching up to me. Oh, I get it. So I have to slow it down. Probably after it passes this. Oh, well, that's not much time, is it? I may have to slow it down at the very end. Because there's no other... There's another room for it. Yep. Oh, I know something's going to pop out of that here in a second. Well, I guess whenever I set that up, it'll uh, pop out all those uh, naked dudes. Johnny. My name is Johnny. Hopefully I won't have to do much adjustment. Ah, interesting. What is the connectors for these? I'm, not I'm really not sure. Oh, yeah, I gotcha. I was kind of curious about what, what actually connects what to what. Probably should have realized it, but yeah. This thing's quick. Like it's really fast. This is why I don't tamper with the classic. You leave the classic alone. That's why they're there. That's why it's the old school. No school like the old school, right? Sad thing is you can predict some of the stuff in this game, but I mean nothing's perfect, so you can't. Ow, fuck, I missed wasted that. Luckily it's just luckily it's an auto recharge, so we'll recharge it every time. Run, 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 speed racer. Alright. Hopefully we're pretty close to getting the suit upgrade. 
Oh, you know what I haven't been doing? I haven't been checking this crap. Oh, well. All it does is give you extra stuff. It's not required. I keep forgetting that. Like, you just get caught up sometimes, and you're just like... It just becomes a forethought, really. Oh, well. There's probably not even one down here now that... I probably passed the part where you could, uh... Did it just kill one? That's quite possible. Something too dumb for them. Good. Make sure it's clear before turning on everything, basically. There's the depot key right there. It's a handgun, a med support handgun, huh? Probably really good for multiplayer mode. Let's go and grab that then. Sergeant Cochran, take the security Hello. key and head to depot 212. I haven't heard a thing from Sergeant Lovell, not since the Franklin incident last week. I'm sure I do not have to express the importance of the supplies stored there. Find out what happened to Lumley, and more importantly, secure our food and ammunition. Oh, I bet that's that one building I passed by earlier to get down here. I don't know if everyone remembers, but I might go check that out then. You know, more chance for salvage and all that. Ooh, nice. New seat. suit kiosk. Now I can repair my suit. Alright. Pump room. Oh, wait. wait. Why would you need two? I guess for co-op? Okay, well, what does this one offer? Yeah, sure. Well, let's check it out at least. And then if, if it doesn't have the upgrades I want, then I'll switch back to my old one. with the oh looks like it keep it keeps my upgrades really huh okay so it's just it's just luck then there's like no point other than that all right now let's do a quick upgrade some, some HP I've got some extra tungsten to do it mess with uh, might mess with the stasis Yeah, kinesis. Might as well, I guess. Like I said, we've gotten some extra tungsten and scrap I can mess with. Do I, no, I don't. Oh, I don't have enough transducer for that one. Duration. Yeah, we'll, we'll save it for now. I think. Oh uh, well. Okay, there is something. Uh, mechanical to it, but overall it's basically Yeah, we fixed the locator now. Might as well we'll uh Hello. Why oh, thank you for letting me out. Back to the surface. Oh and I guess that's that's where I was. Okay, I got you. And that's the. Is that the guy talking about food? Yeah, okay. Actually, does the bot show anything about being. I think it goes, shows going into the, the facility. Yeah. I'm gonna go back to the top now. We don't need to mess with that now. I don't know. If I have some free time, maybe I'll mess with it out, outside of recording, see if there's anything. And like there's a bot spot there probably is but all right so now we've got our new suit we've got some salvage and we've got some uh we've got to go save our friends but they did mention a random spot for food our friends can wait can't they we'll find out in the next episode of dead space 3 thank you all for watching hope you enjoyed and keep warm out there